If you're retiring this year, you may have envisioned yourself moving to a tropical paradise like Florida or Hawaii. However, if you've looked at the cost of living in some of the top retirement communities in those states, you may have been blown away by the prices. But you don't have to let your dream of retiring adjacent to white sandy beaches get away from you. In fact, there are island paradises you can retire to cheaply outside of the U.S. Today on Across the Globe, we're going to be looking at the top 10 tropical islands you can retire comfortably with less than $2,000 per month. Number 1. Isla Mujeres, Mexico Located across the Bahia de Mujeres or Bay of Women from Cancun, Isla Mujeres is a growing spot for expats and remote workers and may be the perfect place for you to consider retirement. This island is home to about 23,000 residents, including expats and locals like artists and fishermen. It's known for being a friendly and vibrant community, nestled amongst white sandy beaches and the turquoise water of the Caribbean Sea. While this island may be small, it's only about 15 minutes by ferry to Cancun. So, you're located within reach of all the amenities that Cancun has to offer. And it's on this list, which means that it's affordable to live here. International Living, for instance, reports that as of 2020, a couple could live a lavish lifestyle on Isla Mujeres with only $2,500 to $3,500 a month. Number 2. Bali, Indonesia In the past, you may have considered Bali as a spot for your annual vacation, but have you ever thought about moving here? If you're looking for an affordable island lifestyle, you may want to consider this Indonesian island. International Living reports that you can get a two-bedroom, two-bathroom place for under $1,000 per month, and you can easily live here off of less than $2,000 per month all in. Ubud is one of the most popular cities on this island for expats, with a little over 74,000 people. This city is located in central Bali and is about 14 miles from the nearest beach. Nomad List says that the cost of living at Nobud is about $1,186 per month, including rent. Kangu is another popular city for expats. Made up of about 40,000 people, it's a resort community on the coast with some of the most beautiful beaches that this island has to offer. The cost of living here is slightly higher than in Abud, but not by much. It's only about $1,296 per month for an individual. If the low cost of living isn't enough to sway you, you may be interested to know that many people speak English here. It's relatively safe and people are generally considered very friendly. Number 3. Koh Samui, Thailand International Living named this island of about 70,000 one of the best islands to retire based on factors like affordability and healthcare. Koh Samui is easily accessible in terms of airports, so it's a good location if you're looking to come and go frequently. The island also has four private hospitals, so is relatively well established in terms of healthcare. Healthcare and airports aside, Koh Samui is incredibly beautiful and is home to world-class beaches. There are also plenty of expat communities here. When it comes to the cost of living, I also have good news for you. According to Nomad List, you can live a middle to upper middle class lifestyle on less than $1,300 per month. Number 4. Crete, Greece while Crete fits more under the Mediterranean climate umbrella than strictly tropical, with its beautiful sandy beaches and more palm trees than you can count, you'll still get your fair share of island paradise if you choose to relocate here. Crete is a particularly great place to retire if you're looking for easy access to Europe and the ability to travel throughout the continent during your retirement. It's relatively easy to access by plane, being only an hour flight away from Athens. You can also take a high-speed ferry, but that does take significantly longer at about six and a half hours. Chenya is one of the most popular retirement communities here and has a population of approximately 54,000. 
And according to Nomad List, you can get by on only about $1,895 per month. Number five, Puerto Rico. If you're an American, you'll find that Puerto Rico is one of the easiest places, legally speaking, for you to retire on this list, as it's an American territory. San Juan has the biggest expat retirement community in Puerto Rico and is home to tons of culture, great food, and of course, practically year-round sun. If you're looking for an upper middle class to upper class lifestyle, you'll be paying about $2,698 per month as an individual. However, according to Nomad List, if you're willing to live a little more like a local, you can easily get by on less than $1,700 per month. If San Juan's population of 335,000 is larger than what you're looking for, you might find another retirement community, Dorado, to be more up your alley. This city has a population of about 36,000 and is known for its high-end lifestyle and beautiful golf courses. Given the upscale nature of this community, however, it does run a bit more expensive than San Juan. Number six, Dominican Republic. The Dominican Republic is one of the easiest places to get to on this list, as there are frequent direct flights between this country and Europe or North America. It's also becoming an increasingly popular retirement destination, and if you've ever looked at photos of this country's 1,000 miles of coastline and white sandy beaches, it's probably not hard to understand why. Las Terrenas is one of the more popular retirement areas, Located in the north of the country on the Samana Peninsula, this community has a profoundly European feel to it, in part because of the international population it attracts. According to International Living, a couple can get by here on about $2,500 per month, while an individual should easily be able to survive on less than $2,000 monthly. Number 7. Phu Quoc, Vietnam you might not think of Vietnam when you envision moving to a tropical island, but the island of Phu Quoc more than fits this description. About 180,000 people live on this island, including a small expat community of a few hundred people. Phu Quoc has about 93 miles of coastline and is home to many of those white sandy beaches you're probably drooling over by now. And there's good news for you if you're considering relocating here. It's affordable. In fact, Nomad List says that the average person can get by on only $1,000 per month, making this one of the cheapest places on our list. However, I will note that this island is a little bit more remote than some of the other places we've talked about so far, so it may be more suited for the adventurous types among you. Number 8. Malta like Greece, I will note that Malta has more of a Mediterranean climate, but it's still got those palm trees, sandy beaches, and year-round sun. Malta has a population of about 534,000. Located in the Mediterranean Sea just south of Sicily, here you can get by on as much as $2,300 monthly if you're living large or as little as $1,080 a month if you're willing to live a bit more down to earth. A furnished two-bedroom in the city of Sliema runs about $1,000 a month. A place with a view of the breathtaking Mediterranean, on the other hand, may cost you about $1,500 a month. Aside from its natural beauty and the opportunity to enjoy the Mediterranean lifestyle firsthand, English is widely spoken in Malta, making it a great spot for expats and retirees. Number 9. Ambergris K. Belize. Ambergris Cay is Belize's largest island and the most popular destination in the country. Located here is the Belize Barrier Reef, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, along with tons of restaurants, luxury beach resorts, and great culture. It's also a popular spot for expats and is known for its combination of natural beauty and upscale amenities. San Pedro is the main town and has about 10,000 year-round residents. You can fly to the mainland in under an hour, making this remote enough to feel like you're in your own private island paradise. The best part, of course, is that you can live cheaply here. If you live like a local and find an apartment slightly outside of the city, for instance, 
you can get by on about $1,000 per month. However, if you're looking for more of an upper-class lifestyle, you should expect to spend more, as much as $4,000 per month. Number 10. Bocas del Toro, Panama This province in northeast Panama is actually a group of nine islands. Over the years, it's developed a thriving expat scene, with most expats living on the main island, Isla Colon, which is home to the town of Bocas Town. This incredibly scenic island has beautiful beaches and miles of rainforest. It's great for the outdoorsy person as it has a more off-the-radar feel to it. Bocas Town itself, for instance, only has a population of a little less than 8,800 people, and you can definitely live cheaply here. International Living, for instance, states that you can find a two-bedroom apartment for anywhere from $450 to $1,000 per month, and that all in, you can comfortably retire here on about $1,100 to $2,200 per month. What about the 10 countries Americans are moving to? Watch this video to learn about that.